Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Legends of the Wind Waker HD. We're in the Earth Temple now with Medley. And also, if we go into this fog down here, we get... I don't know, what's the word? I don't know. We get jinxed. That's the word. And we're not able to use items while it's still jinxing us. If we go into the light, though, it goes away instantly, which is quite nice. Otherwise, it would just go away after a few seconds, so... But anyway, what we need to do now... Since we can't hit that switch that's in the fog over there. Uh, or hit both of those suns with the light at once. Since we've only got one mirror to use. And you're going to light up one thing at a time with it, so. Uh, we're going to need to do something slightly different. And use the command melody. Switching over to medley. Let's go over to the light and... Let's move it in such a way that allows us to light up that switch, I guess. Because it also disperses the jinxing fog, which is quite nice. Now, let me get out my hammer. And hit that switch. There we go. Okay, come on, Medley. Let's keep moving. I have concerns for this room. Mostly because of these bubbles, but also... Also other things are gonna happen, probably. Now, let me get rid of you. That's the wrong one. Let me get rid of that. With the regular arrows, not fire arrows. Okay. This seems safe. Probably. Okay, let's head up here. Move this block out of the way. Which will allow light in. So now we can get that treasure chest, but also... I believe that the switch... will unpress itself if I move off of it. Yes, it will. Okay, so... Let's use the command melody again. It's gonna be a common thing to use the command melody from this point on, basically. Fairly common, at least. Let's just go over here with Medley. And with that chest. And there we go. Now that that's visible, let's put that away. And let's set Medley onto the switch, which I guess I could do without using the command melody. But still. That solves two things at once, which is quite nice. Small key. So we can open up another door. Also, a floor master just appeared after opening up that chest. Floor masters are annoying. And are my worst enemy. Oh my goodness, stay away from the floor master. I think that might just be a hole? No, it's probably a floor master. Just stay off away from it. If it grabs you, it will take you to the entrance of the dungeon, or at least the main room. Like the main first room you go to. I can't do anything in here. Because I don't have medley. That's a shame, so, oh well. Have to come back, I guess? Also, that's fine. If it grabs Medley, it'll also take her back a room or two. Oh my goodness, there's a floor master there. They're really annoying, and just don't really die that easily. I mean, I just took that one out fairly quick, but also, they're probably not, just try to avoid them if you can, basically. Ah, uh, but anyway, we have a key now, so let's go to the other side of the dungeon then. And see what we can do there. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Lots of chews. I'm gonna crash to the wall, that's okay. Um, let's just be very careful. And also throw Medley up there if I can. Nope, okay. Well, what I'm gonna do instead then is burn that thing on the wall, please. There we go, because that's actually going to help us by letting light in. And since the purple shoes turn to stone, I'm actually going to set them on the switches. Please. Oh my goodness. This green shoe is really bugging me. These, these things are going to turn back to normal at this rate before I even put them on the switches. Come on. Come on. There we go. 
That opens up the stairs. So we need to go fast. Come on, Medley. Okay, so as long as you're on the stairs when they return to normal, we should be fine. Because they push us up. But anyway, let's push that this block down so we can have a shortcut. And it also opens the door for us, so that's helpful. <laughs> cool. Let's keep moving. Okay, let's put you down for a second. There's a floor master in here. Okay. No, don't grab me. 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 Okay, cool. Also, if you get too close to its uh, darkness on the floor, that might also pull you in, so you need to be careful of that. But anyway, let's push these blocks around to act activate some things, like the light. That's a good start. And actually, the only thing I can actually do at the moment is so let's command melody to command medley. And let's aim the sun at this wall for one thing. Because that will get rid of that. Get rid of that. But also, I want to turn around now so I can get rid of this wall as well. Which has the second pot behind it. But the other thing we need to do is also get rid of the statue on top of the second block. Or third block. There's, there's a several blocks in here, so... Anyway, let's return to normal, and let's move some blocks, so that we can progress. Also, I feel like- whoa! Okay, you're just gonna move out of the way, off the block, even though it's not gonna get anywhere near you. Sure. The game knows what it's doing. Also, I guess that means that this pot just is open. Just connects to the first one as soon as you break open the wall, probably. I don't know. Anyway. Let's pop that onto there. Which makes a chest appear, okay. I guess they all do different things. They don't, don't all do the same thing by getting all three. But anyway. Let's go ahead and open this. And we get the compass, and we can see thing where things are in the dungeon. Hey. Link, do not worry about sta uh, straying away from Medley in the depths of the temple. Just relax and open your dungeon map. It will show you Medley's location as well, so you can easily confirm her whereabouts. That is quite useful to know about. Okay. Well, before we leave without her, let's just throw her up there and take her with us. Also, what's in that pot? I have to know. Fairies, okay. I could actually put a fairy in a bottle right now, so let's do that. Thank you. I'm gonna set something over that to make sure I don't waste that. I'm gonna use that other one if I can. Nope, okay. Cool. It just went into the wall. That's always a good sign. Got it. <laughs> also, it didn't heal my health. Okay, that's weird. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, we have several things in here. We have Poes and we have Moblins. Just all messing each other up. We want to knock the... Ow! We want to knock the lanterns out of the Poes' hands if we can. But also we can't really attack the Poes because they're transparent ghosts. So... Uh, what we need to do is, oh my goodness, get possessed, which means we have the control stick being inverted, which is a little bit difficult to figure out right now. That's okay, because if we target, we don't need to worry about anything. Also, if we go into the light, we get unpossessed, so. Now, I think I actually need medley up here, quite possibly. So let's just get possessed by this pose so that that just goes away and command melody because apparently I can do that while I'm possessed and that just gets rid of it that's interesting that's actually really helpful oh and by killing them it actually just opens up the stairs that's that would have been even better to know earlier cool let's just quickly do this though to get rid of those statues since there's a treasure chest back there as well and hopefully these statues won't respawn. 
Although I don't think it really matters too much. So. And Medley's going to go back to the door anyway, so. Let's just hop up here. And grab this. Which is... A joy pendant! How many of those do we have now? It's been a while since we got our first one. 36! That's pretty decent. But I still feel like we need more. So, it's gonna be a while. Now, do I need... Medley? I might. I may do. Let me get Medley. Nah, it's rolling. That's not what I was trying to do. I'm flying. That's not what I was trying to do either. I'm just gonna let go and pick up. That's gonna be way easier. Okay, what's in here? This is a room. I That's the best way I can describe it. We have these coffins that will open up. And in three of them, apparently, we have a new enemy. The Redead. Which are terrifying, but also, luckily, in this version, they're a lot easier to beat than the original version. Because if they grab you after they scream to freeze you, they just chew on you and it's terrifying, so I'm just gonna get rid of you. And they also disappear a lot faster than the original version, because in the original version it took them a while to disappear. But anyway, we've got a small key and now we can get out of this pit, which is probably a good thing. Just let me get a few more spoils before moving on. Another rupee, thank you. Okay. And now we have a small key, we can actually go into that other room. Which I don't think we can take Medley into. If I'm correct. So let's go in here. Yep, have to leave Medley behind. It's time for our mid-boss, a Stalfos, which we need to take out to break apart its body and then take out its actual head to beat it up. Come on. It can also reassemble itself after a little bit, so we need to be fast. Uh, you can also use your hammer to break it apart pretty quickly. But one is not the end because there are more. Okay. Grab those. Let me see if I can break your part, maybe. Ow! Please break part. Nope. I think I might be thinking about this wrong, where you can actually kill them if you hit their head. In one go. Yeah, if you hit their head when it's detached, it kills them in one, one hit. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Break apart, break apart, break apart, break apart, break apart. Break apart. Oh my goodness, I split it in half. Got it. Easy. Okay. That's the mid-boss out of the way, and of course, after a mid-boss is usually the dungeon item. You got the mirror shield! Its shiny surface reflects beams of light. Hold ZR to shield. And use uh, the left stick to aim its reflection. So now, we have two mirrors. One which is Medley's musical instrument. And we have the mirror shield, which means we get rid of our, our pass down from generation to generation shield. But now, we can activate this sun switch here by ourselves. I think it's cool that the sun switches have half sun, half moon until you activate them. But anyway. 
Let's just go ahead and grab you. I think also the Poes also just die if they get into contact with the light, so... That's something else that I need to keep in mind, probably. The mirror shield looks so cool, though. It always looks cool, though. And every, every time there's a mirror shield, it always looks cool. Make the Poe visible with the light. And then just attack it. There we go. Ow. Ow. Might get out my grappling hook so I can get their skull nexuses. Please grab. Thank you. Also, I think I did this wrong already. So let me quickly go up here. And command melody. Okay. Let's take Medley across the room. And now, we want to aim the light over to Link. If we can. Thank you. Pretty much spot on. And now we can reflect it back at that wall down there. If I can aim it correctly. There we go. Very nice. Uh, don't hurt me. Just passing through. Where did the thing go? Oh, it's there. This one might take out this moblin. There we go. And probably take this Poe with me so I can get rid of it that way. Pick up Medley and let's go. Now, I'm not sure entirely. Okay, we are fine. Uh, but I will want to do a thing here for this puzzle. I don't think it's actually anything important here, but I'm going to do it anyway. I could be wrong. But anyway, I need to use the A button to aim this at that statue. But then, return and aim at the wall over there. Okay, it's just rupees. I thought it was important, but that looks cool, those rupees like that. Rupees are just cool. Especially with that one video. I can't remember what it's called. And hey, we're back in the first main main room. That's cool. So now, we can use the command melody. Actually, no. Hang on. Go back. I check the map. Let's go get that treasure that we didn't get before because we didn't have two mirrors. Or at least didn't have Medley with us, so we couldn't do it, so. Come on. Let's go. If you throw a Medley into a wall, she gets stunned, which is annoying. Oh, no! Don't grab Medley! Don't grab Medley! Don't! 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 Bum, 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 get! Get on! Get gone! Okay. And this is why Floor Masters are the worst. Okay. In here, and now we have... Mirror shield, we can take out these walls. Don't have to take out both of them, but I'm going to do it anyway. And let's grab this treasure, which is probably going to be a treasure chart. Nope, it's joy pendant. Cool. I mean, it's helpful, but not that helpful. Since it's an item that we can actually grind. Okay, now we can continue on. Go Medley. I think I can actually control her from midair if she's already in midair. Yeah, I can, but also she stopped too quickly for me to do anything. But anyway, let's just aim at the sun switch. And then with the link, we can aim at the other sun switch. So there we go. We can now progress downwards. I, I think we've got all the treasure chests up here, so that's pretty good. Now we can go deeper into the dungeon. There's a lot left. Wow. Let's go. Okay. This could be a problem. Maybe. 
Because we have these bubbles here, but they are curse bubbles. Which means that they will curse us if they get to us, so... That's kind of annoying. Uh, can I, by any chance, shoot you with arrows? No. Um... Maybe ice? Maybe ice? I really need to set this to a different button. No, nope, that one. Come on. Also, I can't aim, apparently. I'm a terrible shot. Absolutely terrible shot. Okay, that does stop them for a little bit, apparently. I'm not sure if it's going to be enough to matter. Or maybe it will. Cool. But anyway, before we move on, I want to go to that secret area over there. So let's take Medley. And let's jump with confidence. I probably should have just dropped. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There are floor masters down here. Don't touch me. I have to leave Medley down here. That's a shame. That's a real shame. That's a big shame. Oh my goodness, why are you like this game? Okay. Also, if I use my Wind Waker... No, I can't, okay. Well, so I'm glad I can just use my Wind Waker using the D-pad. Because I don't think I could do that in the original version. Okay, good. Great. Excellent, amazing. Okay, let's try this again. This time I'm gonna have to press the stop button. Let go. Okay, good. Now I think I can make this jump without medley, which is good. And I think this is where we need bombs. Oh, hello. It's fine. There's our secret tre tre treasure chest. Why are there tingle statues? Like, just in general, why are there tingle statues down here? I don't know. Why are they in the dungeons and why do they exist in the first place? I don't know. But what it, it matters is I got the earth tingle statue. It's cool and damp and it smells like mold. It will be waiting for you on Tingle Island. Okay. Let's head on back. Oh, that's not what I meant. 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 That's not what I meant at all. Please go up the ladder. Oh my goodness. Man, I don't like being jinxed. Slash cursed. Whatever you want to call it. But anyway, we just need to call Medley over here and then we can continue. Okay. There we go. This block should look familiar to us. Works the same as the previous block, it's just there to make sure you have medley with you. Pretty much. Okay, we have... Redeads. To take out, so let's do that. If you can jump attack on a red before it even gets to you, that's good. You can also stun them with light, possibly if you're using medley, so... That's another option. But anyway, let's just light up that... Uh, statue on that block. We can also light up this statue. So allow us to go that way. And also, there's a pillar in the way here, but there's also a mirror there that we can use to light up that block. So now we have a few options, I believe, possibly. Oh, I don't like these options. Why does that loop brown like that? I don't know. Oh, I guess it's that way. Okay, I know where I am. That's the scary part about this. So let's go this way, and I don't think I need to take Medley with me into either way of these rooms, so... 
I can leave her in that room for a bit. Now, this is a problem. <laughs> this is a problem. Because we have this floor master here, and I don't know that I can really take it out easily without just running past. Okay, there might also be another one in there. Which is really just a shame. Okay, curse, that's okay. Just go past, 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 it's okay. Also, we can't even use our sword when we are stuck like this. Anyway, let's get out our hammer. If I can. Okay. So I can hit this peg into the thing. Which will give us some light in the next room if we move this mirror into the right spot. It's also cool that this pl pillar platform thing that the thing the mirror is on has the same crab or scorpion icon that was on Link's clothes at the very beginning of the game. I think it's the same. I don't know. I might be wrong, but I also I'm gonna say it is because I think it's cool. Now, time to go... The other way. He says, sighing deeply. This room is my nightmare. Because there are so many floor masters in this maze with the fog, so you can't see where you're going. And it's just a, f a whole thing. It's a whole thing. Is there one there? Yes, there is. I think it might be better to have the camera in closer, possibly. But anyway, we made it across. We can open up this chest and get a small key. And now comes for the worst part, because I believe if you kill all the, s the floor masters in this room, something happens. I'm pretty sure. I might be wrong, though. But also, that is just not a good time. Because there are so many. They do grab skulls to throw at you as well, if they have any nearby. Okay, let's be very careful here. Okay. Also, countering is apparently a thing you can do to them. But anyway. This, uh, this feels a lot easier than the original version for some reason. There we go. So far, so good. But we're not there yet. Is that the last? No, it's two left. Okay, good. 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 Okay. Last one, I think. Hopefully. No, 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 Yes, it just does appear. Okay. I'm glad I wasn't just doing that for no reason. I almost got grabbed by the last one. Oh my goodness. And we get a treasure chart for doing that. We'll have to check that out once we get out of the dungeon. But anyway, we have a small key now, and we've lit up the next room in front of us. So let's keep on moving. Just need to push this block into the right spot. Oh. Breathing again. Let's just make sure we take Medley with us because we need her. Flying! Please stop flying. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're good. Everything's fine again. Just need to go through here. Okay, now this room is a little interesting, because we have some bubbles in here. Ah, uh, switch arrow, switch arrow, just gonna use regular shots. Okay, yes, come to the light pose. That's a good plan. Makes my life easier. Now, we have to use the angles correctly to actually get... Uh, use the light properly, so... Uh, let's do... That on that block statue thing. I know what I'm talking about. Well, I'm not sure how to explain this, 
I think the light that I reflect off my instrument can be re redirected using your shield link. Do you think we could pr that could prove this could prove useful? I hope you're not offended by my suggestions. I just want to be helpful. No, it's it's fine. I know what I'm doing, but you know, it's, yeah, your advice is helpful, just not to me. <laughs> Since I already know what I'm doing, just don't feel bad. Get the par, get the par, get the par, par, get the par, par, just get the par. Thank you. Now let's use the command melody so we can do what Medley was suggest suggesting. So we need to be over here, directing it that way. So that now we can be over here and direct it that way. There we go. Was apparently behind this pillars wasn't or statues wasn't anything important, so. Gonna get rid of those. Okay, and let's continue. I think we're getting fairly close to the end. Oh, this room. Hang on, I'm gonna go through this quickly and carefully, quickly and carefully, quickly and carefully, quickly and carefully. Let's get this item. Red rupee. What a pleasant surprise. Also, redeads. So that's a thing. Ah, keys as well. Okay, we're good, 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 we're good. Ow, oh, bad. No, bad. Okay, good again. I wonder if fire arrows are good against redeads. I don't know. Oh, hello. Mid boss again. Also, maybe ice? No. Fire? No. Probably shouldn't waste any more things if I can help it. Get slammed, and we're done in this room, pretty much. Cool. Grab that. That rupee. We have another block to get rid of, so let's get rid of that. Just gonna put you down there. The game really seems to give mixed signals about leaving your friend behind, medley behind, and needing to have a to progress. Progress. But anyway, there's the boss door. Uh, but that is also it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.